My name is Elif Bremer Lansen. I am a 20 year old filmmaker from Tromsø in northern Norway. Um, I've been making films since I was 12 years old. Um, and right now I am in South Africa working with a project called Screen, having workshops and making films with youth from all over South Africa for three months. And the industry up north is getting bigger and bigger, and more and more stuff is happening. Uh, Tvibit, the youth film house, is uh, getting bigger and the professional industry takes up young filmmakers to work on professional films. The idea was that I've been surfing up at Unsta several times and I really wanted to make a film from there. Uh, and one time when I was in Gubbelnstar in Norway, I went whitewater rafting. Um, and our guy there was called Kiki, he called himself Kiki. And he was this dread Rasta man from Australia. Uh, so that's where Kiki came up. And then things started developing in my head. Spent maybe over a year, uh, over one and a half year developing the script back and forth, back and forth all the time. Um, I had mentors up in here in Tromso and on Devoted, like Katrina Wallen, who is a really good mentor. We got money from 10 different institutions. We had a total budget of 430,000 Norwegian kroners. Um, we got money from Tvibi Talent Film Fund, North Norwegian Film Center, Active Youth, Active Ungdom, Old Bergruppen, which is a private company in Tromso, and Norwegian Fish Council, and Norland Fylkeskommune, Vesøy Kommune, uh, Sparebanken en Nord-Norge, a bank, and North Energy. I applied these places because some of them had competition, like North Energy had the script writing competition, where the best script got 100,000 Norwegian kroners. Um, and many places I applied, for instance, uh, Norland and Vesøy Commune, we were shooting in Norland Fylke and filming at Vestvogø Kommune. So it's natural to uh, apply for money from those institutions. And for instance from Oddbergruppen and North, the, the Norwegian Fish Council. We, uh, we, uh, I, I just went there and presented the project. Uh, for instance the Norwegian Fish Council, they uh, Film Kiki has a lot of sushi eating and fish balls eating in it. Uh, and we are filming in Lofoten, uh, which is a very beautiful place. And they liked the idea, and there were young filmmakers who were supposed to make it, and they supported us. They reacted with joy, with uh, excitement, because this was something totally new for many of them. Like, old Bagrup had never supported any cultural activities, and there were young people involved. I tried to apply for many other places and most of them said no to me. Uh, that was okay, that's just a part of the money applying business. Uh, you can turn down some places and some places you get yes. So, um, there were a lot of places that I applied, and, but it was okay, I just moved on. I could, you can stop and think about it. Kivit is a youth project house for youth in Tromsø and now sometimes, in, and also nationally and internationally. Uh, the film house, the department where I kind of grew up, uh, is having workshops, renting out free equipment, and providing with mentors, and uh, a meeting base where you can meet. And that was maybe the most important thing that they helped me with, with people, and the place where we could have the production office before we went down to Lofoten. I find a crew through Tvibit's network, people I know, and some people from Oslo. For instance, the cinematographer is from Tromsø, but he's now at the Norwegian Film School, and he took with him a sound, a sound man to work for the film. So we're mainly young people between 16 and 30 years old that are working there. We plan as much as we could, but things always go, turns out differently. The weather changes all the time, 
we had a hurricane for two days and we made a film studio in a soccer hall and it was very challenging in many ways. Long working hours and many people, but still it was one of the funniest weeks I ever had in my whole life, I think. I'm really happy with the, with the result. It's had great... Uh, it's been uh, well received by the audience and I'm very happy. It was a challenge and we managed to get through it and yeah, it was good. The premiere was at the North Cape Film Festival a couple of weeks ago. It was a pre-film before the opening film um, and we got fantastic response. Uh, people were stomp clapping and cheering uh, all the time. During the whole credits they were clapping to the music all the time. So that was really very funny. I think the most important thing and maybe one of the things that I learned the most during this production was that it's very important to listen to your heart uh, and your stomach feeling. If you have, if you meet some difficult choices that you have to make, listen to your Listen to your heart, I think. That's the most important advice, I think.